Good day, guys, and welcome to my channel once more. Uh, today, uh, we're going to talk about making wall settings on AkiCAD. So, let's get to it. Well, before starting any AkiCAD work, there are a few things you need to set. One of those are your wall settings well, before you use them, and also your pen width and your layout, also. If you all know how to do that one. So, for now, this, on this video, I'm going to talk about how to make your wall settings. Maybe previously, in other videos I'm going to do, I'll teach you guys how to do those ones, okay? So now, before, let's let's get right to it, right? So, this, uh, let's go here on the settings dialog, right? Before you go there, you have already clicked on your object, which is the wall setting, wall tools. Then go there on wall default settings. And you have on this panel, geometry and positioning, floor plan and section model listing and labeling tags so i'll explain this briefly for you guys to understand All right so geometry and positioning so in here you have the wall top according to what is said here wall top and this is your uh, the, the 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 height between each levels between each each story but i usually make it uh, north length okay i usually make it north length to make my work easy for me to understand not linked then here you have um structure structure it's basic the, the middle one here that is clicked right now is uh like a wall that has been screeded both back and front then this one is one that have not been screeded okay so what i usually i usually pick this one and then if you look at if you look very well when you when it's on this one this wall thickness is not showing okay so for you to assess this wall thickness you have to click this one then you choose your wall thickness which is uh, mostly 150 mm all right or 250 225 rather 25 mm okay depending on the if it's a story building or is a bungalow what they are doing it means 150 mm okay so here you can choose the structural the the, the, the structural type of the wall you want to use all right so uh, tire walls anything you want to choose but i usually make it airspace make it blank you see why i use that one i'll tell you later all right so this is your wall height which is um 3100 right now but i usually make it 3300 as to give it additional three blocks after your lintel then this is your for your dpc all right i usually make it 450 mm depending on the location of the work you're working what you're doing Right, so let's go down to the next one, which is a floor plan and section. So here you have all relevant show on stories, all relevant stories. What you want to do is to click on home story only. What home story only means is for it to, this is ground floor, this is first floor, this is second floor. So on home story only, it's only on this level that you, uh, you drew your work, your the wall, that's where to show but on all relevant stories to show on every levels of this where well, this um, this work of the story is right here so projected is usually i usually make it outlines only then here is where you set your line type the dotted lines dash or anything then this is your wall your your paint no. your pen width rather sorry sorry for that your pen width is your pen width and they, are, they usually come in different colors and you can choose the thickness not here actually but you can go back to my previous video that i did on pen width if you go to my my channel you see that on pen width how to choose the pen width and the color right this is it and then let me let me use the blue and um, let's go to model on model what model does is for you to choose your color for the surface is it outside or inside or on the edge so we have this is for the outside face surface this for the edge surface and this for the inside okay so if to change it you click here and then you click on this one and this panel will appear right here okay so let me change it to paint titanium and change this around to paint titanium too all right then let's go so this one's listing and labeling you just usually don't work with this one there's no more setting that has to do with your 3d 